Hi, welcome to our video 0 0.11, or 0 0.11, really. Significant figures and calculations. Hi, right, so now that we're all experts on significant figures, we have to talk about how we use them in calculations. And there's different rules for addition subtraction than there are for multiplication. So first, we're going to look at addition subtraction. The rule for addition subtraction is you round to the same number of decimal places as the least precise measurement. So if we look at a math problem here, right, we have 12.52 plus 349.0 plus 8.24. Now the least precise measurement is the one with the least number of significant figures, the least number sig figs after the decimal. So this has two after the decimal, this has one after the decimal, this has two after the decimal. Plug this into our calculator, we get 369.76. However, we're only allowed one after the decimal, because that's our least precise. So we round that using standard rounding rules we should know from math class to 369.8. Okay? The same type of rule applies when we're adding or when we're subtracting. All right, multiplication division is actually easier. <clears throat> Round to the same number of significant figures as the least precise measurement. So we're not looking for how many significant figures after the decimal. We're looking at the number of total significant figures. So here, if we have 2.4256 divided by 8.4, well, 2.4256 has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 significant figures. 8.4 has two significant figures. Which is less, two or five? Well, two is less. So that means our answer can only have two significant figures. So we plug this into the calculator. We get 0 0.291976. We're only allowed two significant figures. So using standard rounding rules, it's 0 0.29. All right, question time. Do each of these calculations, plug it into a calculator, this times this, figure out how many significant figures in your answer. Remembering multiplication and division follow the same rules as each other. Addition, subtraction follow the same rules as each other. Give these a try and we'll see how you did in class. All right, that brings us to the end of 0 0.11 and I will see you guys at school.